happy to have Melissa Ketchum here with Melly Made Artistry. And um, so you actually design your own clothes. So talk about what that process is like. Yeah, um, so the process is really kind of like a deep dive into the soul, which mm -hmm. I know sounds a little out there, but I feel that at Melly Made Artistry, we design ethereal garments that inspire your highest aspiration. Mm. So that's where it starts. It starts like, how do you see yourself? Sure. How do you see yourself in the highest light? And mm -hmm. then from there, I draft up a design, I pattern it, and then I sew it to completion. Wow. You do the whole thing. Yes. It's almost the kind of whole like thing. this is so cool. I just want to I want to point this out. I love yeah. this dress. I'm going to come over here. Yeah. I love this because there's a mm -hmm. there's a cape. I mean, there's look, a this is so <laughs> it's really cool. cool. And then I also love like the like the leg down here. Yeah. Like that is so cool. And then yeah. I mean, who doesn't want to wear a cape? I mean, really. Yeah. yeah. And, and look at the detail on this. I mean, oh. I just love it. Yeah, it's very festive, great mm -hmm. for the holidays. I love metallics. Mm -hmm. um, this hunter, kind of hunter green, I think is really seasonal. Yeah. Um, yeah. So these looks would be perfect for like a holiday party, mm -hmm. even for Christmas if you like to get really dressed up, maybe even um, New Year's. Yeah, look, mm -hmm. look at this one. Ooh, the really dramatic oh, arms again, that. like very yeah. ethereal, goddess inspired uh -huh. things that you don't see every day in the store and just really encompass and embody like power and yeah. strength and beauty. That kind of reminds me of um, like that dress right there reminds me of like a, like Athena, you know, kind yeah. of like goddess of the hunt, yeah, you know, I just kind of like you could go like like bow and arrow hunting. <laughs> Um, and you'd look fabulous doing it. Oh, me? Right? I, I, I guess, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so, whatever. From, from start to finish, how long does it take you to make something like that? Yeah, just depending on the complexity of the design, mm -hmm. it would, um, I would say about a month. Okay. A month or two to just really dive into the process. Again, it's yeah. very introspective as well. Yeah. So these pieces are keepsakes. They're, you know, heirlooms that are passed down from generation mm -hmm. to generation. Things mm -hmm. that hold sentimental value. Yeah, so how does the, um, um, I guess, um, you know, where do you get your material then from too? Yeah, so I like to source online. Um, Etsy's a great place to find fabric mm -hmm. as well. Um, and then of course we have Joanne Fabrics in town. If I yeah. need something quick, yeah. Yeah. just pop over to Joanne's. Yeah. So do people like contact you and with an idea or how does that work? Yeah, so they'll present to me, you know, a few concepts, a few inspiration mm -hmm. pieces. And from there I create a mood board that really just oh. like embodies and encompasses everything that they want from mm -hmm. a design. Maybe mm -hmm. it's a body conscious design. Maybe it's somebody who doesn't want to show their arms or they want to accentuate a certain feature. So mm -hmm. all of that is discussed in the design process. A mood so, board. Yeah. Love that. Yeah. So it's just like kind of a co-creation. Co yeah. You know, yeah. we're creating this design together. And I think so. that that's such an interesting, um, like hearing your perspective on this, it's really like, I'm just going to like, uh, when you're, it's, it's like setting up like with a graphic designer, but mm -hmm. like graphic yeah. design, but like for real life, you know, we're meeting with like an architect almost. Yeah. It's like, how do you want this night to go? Mm -hmm. And also how do you want to remember this night? Yeah, how do you yes. want this to be remembered forever? How do you want to pass it down? You I know? Love There's it. so yeah. many questions that go into that process. That exactly. I think is, um, that's so cool. So what did you, yeah. um, what did you design this for? So this I originally designed um, for Fire and Ice. I've oh. done a couple of looks for the Fire and Ice um, awesome. fundraiser. And this yeah. was one of them that I almost wore. Um, I, went, I ended up going to something different, but yeah. I, I so will wear this definitely soon. <laughs> where can people um, contact you for this? Yeah, so it's been a lot of word of mouth. Um, mm -hmm. You can find me on Instagram or Facebook. Um, those are probably the best ways to reach out. All right. Melly yeah. Made Artistry. Thanks yeah. so much for being Thank here. You. Thank you. Thank you for having me. We'll have more when we come back on Cato Living.